This is a quick video to show you how to edit your teacher homepage. Uh, some of the tools have uh, changed. The toolbar has changed a, a little bit in Sharp School, so I'd like to go over a couple of things with you. First of all, you're going to browse to your campus uh, website, and then you're going to need to log in so that you have the ability to edit your page. Once you've logged in, you'll notice that now you get a new toolbar up here across the top. Um, and we will talk more about that um, here in just a minute. Uh, you're going to go to your teacher web page, and those are all under the staff directory. So if I go into eighth grade, I can see all of the eighth grade teachers that are here. And I can go into a teacher web page. You are only going to have this toolbar across the top, uh, as I do if you have permission to edit that page. And certainly you have permission to edit your teacher page. So what you will need to do is you'll notice that uh, if you wanna go in and change the information um, that is on your page here, then you will come up here to where it says design mode and you will need to turn design mode on. Once you've turned on the design mode, then you'll notice that you get some little um, edit boxes where you can go in and edit your page. Once you click on edit, it will take you into that area. And now we're back to what Sharp School has always looked like. And it is a WYSIWYG or a what you see is what you get uh, web page so that what you put on this page is going to be what you put, um, what shows when, once you have published it. So you simply just click and uh, you can delete things out. You can change names, you can update, do whatever you need to do. Uh, once you are done, you just simply click Publish, and everything now will be live based on the changes uh, that you have made to your page. If you need to add additional pages, notice that now you add pages from this place uh, here, from this button, Add Page, and there are several different types of pages that you can add if you need to add ad additional information there. Of course, you can always contact Kelly Kelso uh, to see um, if there's something different that you need done, um, and I will definitely be able to work with you on that. Thank you.